Well, back to the snowy trails. I kind of want to get to a different corner of the world, because we're kind of exploring the same main area. And I don't actually know where our quote-unquote destination is. If we look at our map, there's like any place that kind of looks like it. I don't really fully know. I actually kind of thought the top area was our destination, but evidently not, because we were just there. It's like not where we really meant to go, but regardless, we're here. We're somewhere. I could zoom in close to the map, but really I'm not using it as a guide. I'm just using it as a general, I've been here, done that uh, scenario. So nothing really hidden there. That's a bit of alcove. Could you really, or, right, take this tree up? Yes, you could. It doesn't really lead anywhere, but it's there. It's got to fall the pathway back on the road again. Making my path. And I guess we are not really going to make any friends because we're kind of by ourselves besides those spirit things. Uh, which way in the path? I think I was actually here earlier. Actually, where I think it is. I'm gonna go to the left for the moment to see if it recurs any memories. I don't know if I've actually been here or not. It seems pretty narrow. I don't actually think I've been here specifically. Or wait! Yes, I have. This is actually how I even ended up here in the first place. Well, sure. That's fine. Maybe it isn't. It is something else. Slow your horses down, sir. Maybe I haven't been here, but I'm gonna go check out that fireplace that's obviously sort of sticking out. It looks interesting enough, and there's a trail leading up from it. This is the trail I took earlier, and obviously, yeah, you know what? I think this is the school path trail I just took a little bit before this. Which means I didn't take that path I just took specifically, but I've most certainly been here before. Can I climb up there to that. Kind of. But also not really. But I'm almost 100 sure this is where I thought it was. Is there anything over there? Yeah, that is definitely the pathway I took earlier. Which means and in this back low crevice. One of those rocks. Actually, it looks like they go a little bit further than that. No, nope. well, I mean, it does go further than that, but not a way that we can actually take. It kind of looks like something in the distance, you have to admit. Part of me is tempted to climb up the trail again, see if I can find what I was looking for previously, but... Actually, climb this. A certain way, but not really. We couldn't possibly walk past branches, so whatever. This does catch the eye as well, though. It seems like a big old cave entrance in here. I've certainly not been in here, so let's take a look. There's actually a note immediately. Sure, I'll read it. The Soviet Research Union for Natural Phenomena regarding the occurrence of anomaly 0H91. First incidents took place in 1950 and 1953 in the areas of Ngarko by the construction of the Transpolar Main Line. The works were halted, incidents classified, and any witnesses were ordered to be eliminated. On October 17, 1950, according to witness evidence at the same altitude as Camp 503 to the west of the Ngarko uh, city, an eminent of a known force and source occurred and caused instant death of 42 workers. The bodies literally evaporated, and only shadows were left as the witnesses terrified uh, testified. The incident was sudden and short. The next incident took place three years later on March 14, 1953. Then, also in the above-mentioned camp, a solidification effort occurred. The bodies of 12 workers just froze. After autopsy, they were declared dead. The bodies are still lying intact in Section 12 of the Cerverus Research Complex. Whoa. 
okay. We got science experiment things going on here, it sounds like, but yeah. There's nowhere else to go here, that's what it's like. I'm going to assume, looking up the mountain, part of me is tempted to try and, you know what, there were, there was stuff over there I never really found how to get to. I'm gonna try and trek it once, and if I end up in the same place, I'll just head back. Or jump down the mountain, whichever way is really fastest and safest. So I'm gonna pay attention to see if there's any routes that I could have taken differently than I took when I was here before. Last time I crossed that log. When I get to that log, then there's really no other way for me to go. I did have though see a fireplace that was behind a wall that I couldn't access. I'm not sure if I ended up in that fireplace elsewhere, but I don't think I did. Yeah, I don't think there's another route. It's fairly straightforward. Science? Well, this turned out a lot better than I expected. Here we are. You know what, actually, while well, I'm over here, I don't want to tread the ground I came from. I'll go back here, I'm gonna take the other split in the path I did not take. I don't remember this. Uh, let's see, 10 north, 47 east. up <laughs> uh, that's a good question oh I think I know where I ended up from so that was just a dead end that led to that okay I've got a good idea where I am well I'll go this way Life is adventure and all that, so if you don't go adventuring, what are you really living for? Over here was an fort. Actually, no, this is not a dead end. Is this where I came from? This is my second question. This could be where I came from. I remember this. This is where I was saying if I go left or right, and I decided to go right. It's actually it came the way I wanted to go. I'll go left then, because I have not been over here. Or it's a dead end. Of course. Just a nice, lively dead end like I got to for no real reason. Well, at least now I know. I'm sure there's more I could go explore on this mountainside and all that, but really, I've had enough fun here at the top area of the map up here. That's where I've been sort of exploring for a while. There's a whole other huge area I still have not... Huge areas? I've only explored like a fourth of the area so far. Maybe even less than that. There's a lot more to explore. I don't really know where our destination is. If we end up at our destination, then we'll end up at our destination, but until then I kind of want to explore the area. A bit more thorough. That's nothing. I know this is kind of loose around, but I'm just looking at this. Alright, catch your breath, and now I guess we head back. The radio tower we'll try and save going to, because obviously catches the eye. Ugh. We good. We're back in the, this area. We've done the most thorough job we're going to do exploring here. Probably not coming back to this area, so I think we missed. We unfortunately missed this. Of course, we have to go back here for story reasons. We've kind of looped around the mountain all the way, so let's head back. The only problem is, though, I know where I am on my map. I should be crossing back over. I know the little lodge there. I don't know exactly where I've been or where I'm going. Yeah, here it is the decrepit tree area. Dead 
bad for no reason. There is, however, though, a symbol up there. I'm not sure it's a symbol, it's just something on the wall that kind of looks like a star, regardless. <clears throat> Catch my breath. Let's get back to exploring. Part of me wants to see if I can get to that radio tower, and I guess maybe that'd give me a place to go where I haven't been. There's probably other points of interest to spot out. I also want to see if where I just was was the yellow mountain I saw earlier. I didn't quite piece together. I think maybe it was, but I'm not 100% sure if that's actually what it was. Regardless, we've come back to the mainland, or at least going back inward land instead of exploring the top area. This map is legitimately pretty big for a game like this. We circled all around up back there, and here we are again. I think this bridge is where we crossed initially. Yeah. If we go over here, I think we're going to end up in the stone column area. I'm not sure if I should do that or not do that right now. Still got so many questions. If I see the stone pillars, I actually think I'm going to follow the other path. Yep. It's the stone pillars, which means I know exactly where we are right now. I'll take the route I haven't explored over here. I don't think I actually took the under left route. So I haven't really fully explored this side of area. I might as well just follow. Well, at least I kind of know exactly where I am on the map. Yeah, there's a path down here. I'll follow the path and see where it takes me. Wherever it is that it takes me, really. Assuming this drop doesn't kill me. Let's find out. That drop will kill you. Now we know. However, though, I know another path up that we didn't take. I was just saying if you could actually go down there. Technically, maybe, but he just died the only he tapped us on. Wait, wait, where is this? Where am I? Okay, okay, I know where this is. It saves when you pick up notes, so it led me to where I picked up my last notes. So I a little bit of footwork still to make again, but really this could be a lot worse. I both understand and think it's a bit more realistic with the stamina system the character has in place in this game, but I also very much dislike it for exploration reasons, especially for a map this large. We're not really running away from monsters or anything, at least right now. So I think that the stamina system could benefit from being a bit longer than it is, but you know, whatever. It is what it is. No huge reason to complain about it. There is nothing over there. We're just checking to make sure. This is the perfect atmosphere to tell ghost stories. It would be a good atmosphere for it, really. Well, let's cross over. Wow, that was just a big old change of atmosphere right there. Not like atmosphere in terms of tone. Atmosphere is literally the atmosphere. Well, time to take that path I never took before. Instead of going to the central area, with this branches out to all those multiple areas. I'm going to take the bridge path again, because there was a pathway over there, which I never took, because I circled back around and ended up here, so... I guess I'll check over here, see where it leads to. If anything, really. No, I'm going to have to get to that bridge, basically, to be able to do anything. Easy enough to do, but I wasted my stamina. It's time to move in super slow again. Or is I have the stamina system? But yeah. I don't know which, which way it would be faster to get to where I want to go. I'll go this way because I think it the other way previously. Is this it? Well, it's sizzling somewhere, so I'll follow it. Snowy nights. Crossed into snowy little plights. Is the 
is a dead end. I think this is a dead end. Which is unfortunate. Don't even see a page or anything. Oh, maybe I hear one. It's hard to tell with the loud wind here. I don't think I do, though. <laughs> Guess this pathway leads to nothing but an unfortunate dead end. Look at the map. Maybe I ended up there. Well, let's continue then. to stick to the high paths in this case and see what all we can do. Of course, they'll be a little wary because of tiredness, but yeah, I... I must be pushing my character too much because he's been getting tired a lot more recently. Um, limited running for me. We were here earlier, but I think I can uh, cross over to an area I have not been from here, so... sliding down. But yeah. <coughs> There's also a trail that leads down here it looks like. Now I'm going to go this way just because I know I can make it. <gasps> Fuck you! And I know where it's going to load me all the way back to fucking A. Kind of disliking the checkpoint system in this game. I know where it's gonna lead me to. It's gonna be the cave back where we picked up the last page. Yep. You know what? I'll take a different route. I won't go up on that bridge. Fine. Okay. Sure. Kolot God, whatever rules the mountainside. All hail Odin. I don't know. <laughs> I'll just take a leisurely stroll here on the ice lakes. Passing over to see where I go. Now, my furthest assumption, my at least, I guess, closest assumption is to say I should probably be a bit cautious. This time I was head towards the rock pillar area and take a different route as opposed to trying to find the route I met, uh, skipped over earlier. I'm sure I'll loop around some other place. Or, uh, but now that I'm thinking about it, I'm like, no, Ryan, but we know where that route was. We were almost there. We just failed at crossing that chasm. You can't jump in this game, people mind, so... Yeah, I... We made it before, though. The only unfortunate thing is we don't have the page checkpoint if not if we don't make it this time. I think I went too far and passed over the path that we need to take. Let's cross over here. Da 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 da. Jugging my head. On ice lakes that could split at any moment. Let's go on down and follow this path here. Which means we should uh, be done exploring the northern hemisphere of the mountains instead of going back south. I'm debating with myself. What do you guys think? I'm going to ask you guys right now as I make my way. I think I should try and go down the path I haven't explored. There was a path over there I never went down. And I circled myself back to where I went up to the northern hemisphere there. Or should I just go to the central pillar column area and just take a different path from there? What do you guys think? Let's take a leisurely jump. I'm almost at the decision intersection point. Let's see if anyone actually answers that question. Yeah. 
Yeah, fuck, I'll try once more. If I fail this time, I'm not gonna do it again, but the temptation is there. The temptation of exploring the corner over that way, which I never got to explore. I think we can make it, but still, though. Let's continue upward. Just to make the assumption that we probably can't turn around this way. No one answered, but that's okay. I think we're thinking about that, dear. Uh, we'll have to cross over the bridge and hopefully make the jump a okay. Can we make it? The answer is probably yes, but we'll find out in time. Will this be a leap of faith moment? Um, probably. Sure my stamina is okay, I don't actually bump off the rock again. Okay, we made it. Congratulations to us, we didn't fall the second time. Now we were here earlier, but there was a path over this way that we never took. So we took the opposite way. So I'll circle around here. Last time we went that way. We never went this way. If it's a dead end, I would be like, oh. But hey, until we know it's a dead end, let's go explore. Life can be full of mysteries. Somewhere. Actually, it seems to be laying inside a cave. Sure. New cave to explore. This direction is clearly new for us. This cave is also full of whispering. Oh, we're getting a lot closer to the radio tower. Also, let's see how this wall is algae and all over it. The whispering's also notably gone away. Well, this is in fact a new area, so. Let's cross through. Which means I guess the radio tower is our next destination if we're aimed directly towards it. Is this narrator not us talking? This didn't mention the abyss again from that note that we picked up. There was like three different paths right there, but I'll take this one first. These lead up to something. Okay. Radio tower, I guess you're our next destination. What a nice forest. Oh, but there's like multiple different pathways. Why is the decision of which way to go never the easy is the answer? So many branching paths here. I'll have to come back here and explore a bit more thoroughly in a little bit. For the moment, I'm going to go head up the mountain. Mountain, mountain, what's up, you? It's a lot darker up here than it is in other parts of the mountain. So maybe the storm is starting to finally show itself more fully. It's an open area. Obviously also a dead end. Okay. The pathway up continues. Obviously, I hear a note nearby. There it is. Got some supplies next to it. Let's read it. Anomalies do not exist. Notice how the notice there. When almost 20 years ago, I 
wrote about a strange anomaly occurring in my city. As a reminder, I reported spatial distortions in between buildings. They thought I was nuts. Since then, mankind has been witness to thousands of strange, mysterious, and unexplained events and phenomena around the world. Allow us documented and supported with hard evidence. Unfortunately, to this day, prominent scientists seem not to notice or simply underestimate this, this issue. We have asked Dr. Jarvis Northam from the American University of Technology and Life Sciences. Anomalies appearing practically around the globe is an undeniable fact. We know that at least several dozens of such events take place in Russia and the United States, but we have also received many reports of strange, extraordinary, and sometimes dangerous phenomena. Authorities must stop avoiding this issue because every year we register an increase in these so-called anomalies occurring. I do not know what causes them, but frequently the repercussions are tragic. Add to that the helpless attempts to cover up these events by the government of particular countries that are just becoming more and more pathetic. In 1998, Kremlin officially denied that the Special Natural Phenomena Research Unit established in the 50s was to, to deal with anomalies in any way. Eh. Of course. Let's drop down there, which means it's going up. There's another one of those weird post stuff. Where's the radio tower? Oh, there's a church up here. Spirits running here. alone here. Oh. Speak of the devil. The radio tower is still far away. There's a church over there. How do we get to it? There's no way I'm missing my chance to get to that church. Is there just a pathway up here to lead me over here? I don't know how we end up over there. Bug me so bad. I want to explore over there. I guess I was exploring over here, so I'll continue exploring over here. Follow this path and see wherever it takes me, basically. Maybe I'll somehow loop around. I took a left there earlier. 
I'll go down this way then. I hear another page sound, so I guess I'm gonna locate that. Sounds like it's above us. Then we have to circle around to it. Well, let's circle around to it then. Well, there's more pathways. This actually might lead to where I want to go. You have to go faster. I don't have a lot of time left. You have to hurry. Find the way. Find me, or I'll unleash hell upon you. I might be going to the story location. Oh, oh, this is a time thing. Uh, let me catch my breath here for a second. Yeah, this is a time deal. Everything's to bypass. So I'm assuming the voice talking is actually not my character talking. Someone else talking to him. Oh, we're arriving to the church, I'm guessing? I kind of went this way because I was hoping to find a note, but... Sounds like we're approaching the church regardless, though. Can I just walk up this? I'm taking this pathway and hope to find the note that I heard earlier. doesn't seem so. Where the fuck did I come from over here? There it is. There's the church up ahead again. Well, they circled around back to it, I guess. Hello, church. Is the church the main location we're supposed to be visiting? I didn't really realize there's a church over here. But hey, I guess there was. I'll go investigate, I guess. There's a page definitely here, and there's also a radio tower we can still see. Ooh. We need to find a way inside the church quickly. go, a nice little church area to uh, take shelter in and a note about it. Sure, I'll read the note. Sure. For a very long time, I could not come across any trail. The tracks came and went as if someone was playing with me, as if the victims were moving. 
And as soon as I was almost sure I had seen something and I would find something new behind the next tree, the trail suddenly went cold. I had no idea what was going on. Finally, I reached a small meadow. There, I found a bound journal, as if someone left it there on purpose. The journal belonged to the members of the expedition. They wrote down their thoughts and observations. Note, there were also some obscure entries, probably taken down in the dark, concerning the situation they were in. This could shed some new light on the case. I am attaching the journal to this report. We have to control the conduct of the investigation and at a certain point stop the information flow. The facts concerning the incident cannot be made public in any way, shape or form. Holding a secret, it sounds like. Fortunately, I did not see the thing they kept bound. For a very long time, I... We're good. Is there something more we need here? The clouds are completely dispersing, so... We have found the bell scene. According to my map, because it seems like the main events are crossed off, that would be the 54 event one. Which means this wasn't the main thing we need to go to. Maybe we're just supposed to... Maybe the whole point of the game is to trigger all the events. I don't know. But I'll walk back out now. Good old graveyard. Just kind of appreciating all the dead people. Honestly, there's another way to go besides the way that we came, which unfortunately so far looks like a negative. I looked, I tried. It is what it is, what it is. I guess we have to look either over here or come back the way that we came. I'll see if there's anything over here to the left for the direction, but if there's not, then the only choice is to go back the way that we came. My character catches breath for a little bit and let's move. Can I cross on down? You think we can make that leap? We just got a save point, I'm gonna try. See if this leap is makeable. Almost. 